I came to win, to fly, to prosper, to ride. I came to win, to survive, to prosper, to fly. I made that up. To yeah. fly, to fly. I came to win. To fly, to prosper, to ride again, to win, to survive, to prosper, to ride. That's every day. Wait till you get copyrighted, wait. <laughs> get out! Get out! Get it out! Can we get copyrighted for you just say it? Stop! No. I don't want to hear it. That's so, it. All I can help. Baby boy, thinking about you. She killed it. From that? I know I see. I see. I don't know what these lyrics are. It's just me and you. Okay. Um, if you're Beyonce, you're not doing petty meeting greets. <laughs> no, you will. No money can buy that's your what, time. That's what I'm saying. But I'm saying she probably would do but, meet Seven thousand's a lot, mom. Yeah, but you're going to meet her. I, I better be on the bus. You I better be on the tour bus. You taking a picture? I'm coming with you. I'll be at every. I'll be in Vancouver. I'll be in Sacramento. <laughs> I'm going to. I'm going to all the cities for seven thousand. Australia 000. and all that places. Yeah, I'm gonna be backstage too, going like this. With the with the uh, the stage manager, I'm gonna say. Not for oh. seven grand. She said, "Blue light does not look good on black girls." Who said that? Beyonce. She said blue light does not look good on black girls. You ever seen that? Blue light? Oh my god, Beyonce has so light? much. Like blue light. Like just lighting. Like when she's on stage, she they have blue light on her. She said, uh-uh. Oh my god. I, you know what I love so much? Watching the videos and Beyonce's just in control. Like she she literally will have all these people going. Like she'll be sitting down just like just so hard pressed. Like you see on her face. And she's like, she's like looking at all the designs that these people are giving to her. And she's going, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. If you see over here, if you look. Blue light does not look good on black girls. And when I'm when I'm standing right there, I want the light to be shining from this way and not that way. In order for the audience to see me, I need them to see me from from right there. Who made this? No, I don't want it. Also, when I, I want the, the the violins to come in after the piano, you you hear? Just play it for a second. Right there. That's when I want it to come in because otherwise they won't feel the the. I just love that. She's just giving me. She knows what she wants. <laughs> I promise the videos everywhere we're doing that. What's up, my lovelies? You guys, today we are having church's chicken again. We are going to do our say our grace and then do our thumbnail. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for this food that we are about to receive. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. And this is what we're going to do. Can I see churches right there? Can we do our thumbnail? I forgot. Oh, wow. The boy's so hungry. I don't know if I should do this. Thumbnail. Mm. There, what is your thumbnail gonna be? Ooh, get on my nerves. No, but can't wait to eat. Anyways, y'all, we had to do the Popeyes, not Popeyes, churches again because some of y'all asked to do it, us to do it uh, while we were, excuse me, while we were. In the house, so y'all could see a better view. So I got me some chicken and some mashed potatoes and some macaroni and cheese. Did they have macaroni and cheese without them? Yeah. Now wait, let me taste the macaroni and cheese because I'm not the one. Now, mm. you know it's what I, all right. You know. And what I say is all right because it's not your not your homemade one. Is it? You know. It's like the one you will get in the frozen section and just heat it up. Yeah, this this old country buffet. This is gonna growl. Whatever. It's not too bad. It's not crazy bad, y'all. I like macaroni and cheese that are almost like casseroles. Mm. That are like more. I dry love their potato salad though. They make mashed potatoes. You like what? I like when they have. And macaroni and cheese is more like casserole. You know oh yeah, with the cheese all on yeah. top. Um, you know what I realized you could say? Because like, 
we read all the comments. We could just say, oh, I'm only doing this video because so many people requested it mm -hmm. and no one requested it. They'll Who never said know. That? No, I'm just saying, but they'll never know. Oh, yes, they will. No, they won't. A lot of people read my comments. I know, but I'm just saying so many people were, were emailing me and DMing me saying that they wanted me to do this church chicken video. So that's why I'm doing it. They'll never know. But don't nobody talk to you, though. No, I'm just what was that? What I don't know what you got. I don't know what that means. What do you mean you don't know what it means? I don't know what that means. So, oh, y'all yeah, got corn on the cob, too. Mm -mm. What? You take the hot sauce, the thing? Tell them what you got. You ain't even told them what you have. I'll be back. Be back with what? I'm going to heat all this up. It's too cold? Yeah. Mine's ain't. Yours right there too. Come on, home. My chicken's cold. It's not cold, but it's loop. Now I'm after what? Yeah, it's loop one. <laughs> we have a microwave in our beef. Yeah. There's bye. There's a lot of people with microwaves in their basement. Nuh-uh. Uh-huh. Anybody got no microwaves in their basement? Yeah, you do. Do they have it on all five floors of their house? Like we do? Yeah, we don't got no five floors, so you better Goodness. stop. Stop telling our secrets. Now, I don't know if my stuff new or... Yeah, it's warm enough. Hey, believe me, I can upgrade you. Now, was it worth the drive, Mom? Mm-hmm. Was it? I love chicken. But was it worth the drive? Yes, it was. Could we have gotten some Popeyes? Mm, ah. Uh, Cause they, I, I, churches is all yonder. It's, I promise you it's in the next state. It's in the nearest state. Darius? Hmm? Be quiet. That's why the food is Luke. That's good enough for me. I know. Because you like cold chicken. Now, I'm about to go get me a real fork. Because these sporks don't I'm work. Like these sporks don't work when you're trying to grab chicken. Mmm. That's a little tough. Now. Now the fries that can't be saved. So, oh, I forgot. Now jalapeno peppers. Mhm. Mm now, and taste the fry. Mmm. So no for me. Um. What is wrong, Mama? So, like how? Actually, kind of have a good um potatoey taste. Uh huh. But. What? Mmm. -hmm. Got in your bag. I feel like I've had this meal before. Oh, I have. You have when? Do they eat those same thing? Yes, I did. Except for I didn't have. Mmm. Fries and macaroni, but everything else is the same. I got raw. I can't even holly uh, a lot. I promise she did a lot. She said I got my the raw kind, so which are from the super. I did a lot. I really did do a lot. I don't know what I did, but in the south now somehow both of my forks have back on the cheese on them, and I specifically had two separate forks. This is why I don't like sporks. I'll be back. We got a lot of issues today. I know, and I'm not having it. Oh, y'all. I have sneeze. Oh, baby.
bless me. Whew. Thank y'all. So, I'm extra spicy. And, uh, goodness. I hide one plastic fork in the crevices of our house, and it's gone. Somebody took it. I don't know how. It had a hot sauce bottle top on it, and I bet you it was you opening something. And I was going to use that. It was a good, nice, sturdy one, too. And you wasted it on opening a hot sauce bottle. Oh, yeah. I'm just gonna now. I have to use a real fork. And you gonna wash it? Afterward. I'm washing it. Mm-hmm. Hey, we had a. Ooh. You got this water. So them jalapeno poppers are good. You have one? Mm-mm. I'm saying because a lot of people in the audience were saying it was good. It was kind of like a car. They liked them. Potatoes. I almost should have got two potatoes. That's how good they are. I think I like that. Better than anybody? Let me see. No, I think KFC is coming in first. Excuse me. Mom, <laughs> what kind of Avengers Age of Ultron? Just came out of your stomach. Oh, give me a napkin. I don't know what that was. It was like coming up in little sequences. Like, no, a little. That came up. <laughs> out of the divine revelation. Oh my God. That was crazy, wasn't it? It's like. No, you don't have to recreate it. Okay. I don't know how people bark on purpose. Yeah, I don't either. I don't do it on accident. So you don't burp. Darius, bye. You ever heard me burp? Mm -hmm. No, you haven't. Darius, you say same thing about your passing gas. Um. You yeah, can't. Of course I burp. But okay. I make it so you can't tell. You ever heard me burp? Darius, please. I keep my mouth so shut, so soundproof, you can't even hear. 
And how you do that? Mm -mm. I know you don't know. Now, don't make me give you the manual. Do you really have the manual? Do you want me to ask for the manual? Well, I'd have to think of the manual because it's just right. natural to me. Exactly. It's just natural to me. I'm gonna finish all of this. Hmm. I won't buy it no more though. The mac and cheese. And I got some corn on the car. I'm gonna do this, y'all. I know I'm not supposed to be eating this. Why? Well, not like that, oh. but they say I couldn't. Mm-mm. Now I'm gonna be fine with the You don't think? They said I couldn't do it, but I'm just trying to nibble. Over here eating gum. <laughs> I'll be letting them know. I promise. Mm. Talking about some mm. No, these peppers are too high for me. I'm doing a lot. They have a lot of seeds in them, and I don't know if I'm here for it. What? These peppers. Whoop. Now, I forget I have so many sides. This is a lot. Okay, I'm just getting them. Uh, y'all, this is going to be a lot of smacking, so y'all. Because it's not sweet. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Hmm? Mm hmm. I promise I didn't have to hold me a popper. Did I eat the whole thing? Goodness. Mm How -hmm. about him? Popper. Oh. You ate the whole thing? Are you greedy? Because I'm who? Greedy. I guess I won't eat all my food. You what? Hmm? You better eat all your food. Okay. I know y'all we ain't talking. I enjoy our food. Y'all probably get tired of chicken. But I just did rotisserie chicken. And then, I'm gonna be doing jerk chicken. This is not good. Oh my goodness. Hmm? I don't know what that means. What? You said this one got good. What's wrong with it? Oh, man. Mm -mm. I can't right there. I can't. It ain't worth it. So the corn is a no go for me. The macaroni's a no-go. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna finish it though. Um jalapeno poppers are a yes. Mm-hmm. The jalapeno poppers. Mm-hmm. The chicken's a yes. Mm-hmm. Bone. The biscuit. Biscuits, I don't like, but I know I'm gonna like it after I finish eating. And it's like a is it well, last time I didn't like it. When I bit into it, and all of a sudden it did one of those, have you ever eaten something you don't like it and then all of a sudden it said you want another bite? And when you get another bite, it's on point? Mm-hmm. Or like you don't like it when it's in your mouth, but when it leaves, you want it back. 
Have you ever had that? I promise. Like, it's not good. <laughs> but then, like, you want it. Oh, yeah. Like, it, it has, like, a good, a you know, like, some things have, like, an aftertaste? Mm -hmm. Like, the aftertaste is really good. So you just eat it because you want the aftertaste. You took your stuff out of the box. Um, they said they like to see your food. I know I'm over here eating out. I didn't even realize. Well, it's my last chicken bee, so here you go. You can move the box, though. Oh, yeah, I could. Ooh, that was smart. The light bulbs sometimes don't work, y'all. Now, I knew it didn't work. I didn't say, oh, that looks kind of good. I can't tell it's spicy. No, it is not. Oh, because you got both? Mm-hmm. Maybe because I got half of them all. Uh -huh. Duh. Do you think that was smart? Mm-mm. Nah, no, um. Mm. Okay. Mm, what? She a little fruit beach fuzz. Mom, I just shaved too. You see me when I didn't have my hair cut mm -mm. for three weeks? Uh-uh. I had a, the beard was coming on the middle of my cheek. That's how you know it's going to be a full one. And I'm not going to be looking like that, not today. What's wrong with his beard? A lot. I don't know wrong with his beard. I don't like it. Ah. Right. At all. Look like taco meat to you? No, that's weird. You seen that? That look before? <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. Now, let me see this biscuit. She's cold. You want to heat her up? Yeah. I'm yeah. Gonna... Let's do this. Oh, yeah. Do this bag and put the whole bag in there. I'll just get one of those. Y'all done with the ACT there? Yeah. So it was only for one day? Two. Oh. What was the second day? Work keys. You did the second day? Yeah, today. What was the... I spent oh. five five hours on the work keys. All right, and you got a whole... Five, but... Huh? And y'all had a whole day of work in this school. We did the work keys, and then we had to do... Had to go to uh, fifth, sixth, and seventh hour. Mm. Why you had to go yesterday? Cause yesterday was the entire day. No one had school yesterday except for juniors. Today, oh. everyone—it was a regular school day, but all the juniors were cornered off in different sections of the school, and everyone. Oh. Um, was Wasn't no school for nobody else. Not yesterday. Mm. Last year, I got to chillax yesterday. Last year, yesterday. Yeah. Whatever. Well, I don't know when the ACT was, but whenever it was, I got to chillax. You know, you was happy? But I swear there's but a day. But next year, you'll be able to do that. Yeah. But I swear there's a day coming up where I get to. Because they. Because the. Sophomores and freshmen have to take ACT Aspire. And I swear I get to go in late that day. You I what? better. I better get to come in late that day. Or, like, not come in at all. Well, we'll see. What's what's um, what's that, Aspire? Uh, aspiring to be good on the ACT, so it's a practice test. For seniors? <laughs> no. Oh. For freshmen and sophomores. Uh-uh. Did they see y'all last year? Yeah. Now, let me see. These don't look creepy. Oh, yeah, they do. Yeah. But the thing is, I wish they were infused with honey. That'd be delicious. But they're not. We better. And then they're gonna have to say, 
Well, we don't we don't have honey packets. We don't carry honey packets. We ain't got them. You know. He didn't say like that. Yes, he did. Well, he didn't say like that at all. But that's what I took from it. Goodness. I got biscuits with no honey. Forks no knives. Boy, bye. Chicken no sauce. They got they stuff infused. They did have chicken no sauce. She said, well, we only got barbecue right now. This is not the one we went to in St. Louis. What? Wow. They didn't have green beans. Mm -mm. They didn't have, um, what's it called? Those corn nuggets. Oh. That I saw online. Mm. That were at the other place. They didn't have them there. Come so we ain't got no honey. They had two sauces for the for the wings, two. And the one she said she was out of, and then she realized the guy had had some more. Uh. You should realize it. So let's just go um and put on um the Monique thing. Uh -huh. You wanna talk about it? You wanna talk about it? I can't cause I don't know what it's about. Mom, I told you about it, so let's see if you're listening. Let's see. You can tell me a little bit about it. I'll tell you the story. I can't do this anymore. Uh, I just want to go to sleep, man. You done? With school? Yeah. I didn't ask you that. Oh, I'm tired. I know. I'm go to school every day. Tell some. Hey, I, Mom, I, I don't think you understand. I was testing for five hours yesterday. Okay. With less than a minute of question, my brain was going like this. Then it said, okay, two minutes. For and Mark? Said, no. Um, oh, two minutes left? No. After you get done, they have to go over the instructions for the next test, the next section. Uh -huh. So it's two minutes. It's basically a break for you to go. And then you're running again. And then after that, they go, okay, ten minute break. And I, I kid you Can not. Can you bring in snacks and stuff? Not into the testing room. Mm -hmm. They won't let you bring in snacks. You gotta keep your phones in another room. Of course. Because you can cheat, right? Mm. Mm-hmm. You can look up stuff. Yeah, but there's three officers in the room. Not police officers. I'm about to say. <laughs> what? They're called like ACT officers or something like that. Which are really just the teachers of the of the, of the school. Oh, and they try to make sure that, ain't nobody cheating. Well, they walk around during the test. Has anybody ever been called cheating? Um, not mom. I'm only taking the ACT one time, mom. Would you? Well, well, well. Back in my day when we was taking the ACT. What are you talking about? I've only. This is the first time I've taken. A, I don't know what you mean. Why was anybody caught cheating? Like, has, has anybody ever caught cheating? I don't know. Maybe. Don't you know how they told you? Cause you have your paper towel and your thing. Remember that thing for you AP went exams? to? For AP exams. Right. And you was like, we know all about it. Somebody got taught cheating. They told us this and that and that. I want to know if they told you that. So don't act like they don't tell you stuff like that. No. No. Now eat a biscuit. I eat a biscuit. I eat my pies. These are those apple pies, y'all. No. Yes. No. Yes. I've never liked a pie from anywhere. The only thing that I'll eat close to a pie is the, the empanada. From Taco Bell. Ooh, that looks, look at that right there. Yeah, that looks gross. I can tell that crust is nasty, and I can tell that it's dry. And not even sweet. Bet it's not sweet. Mm -hmm. Check, check, check all of the above. I knew I was right. You don't like it, do you? I actually like it. I actually do like it. Mm -hmm. Are you happy? No. Are you sure? Yes. Pretty good. Crust good? Mm hmm. Is it sweet? Mm hmm. Don't trust you. Look at the sweet. Why would that be good? Mom, looks are real deceiving. I know. Right. It just looks like my mean old meanie, Bobini Slovini. But then when you get to know me. What's the issue? Yeah, when you get to know you, what? Because you be a trip. I'm about to sue for defamation of character. Oh, uh -huh. you're telling people that I'm a trap. Every three seconds you get. Mm -hmm. uh, you do a lot. You do. I promise I don't. You do. I don't. Tell my chivalry is dead. 
Now, <laughs> you did a lot. You did a lot. I never said chivalry was. Oh my god. See? I'm suing for definition of character, I promise. No one ever said that. Over okay. here, I promise I'm suing. I'm gonna say uh, it's gonna be Darius against the court of law versus. I don't know what I just said. Versus B Loves Life Incorporated. Because mm -hmm. I'm not the one. No. Uh -huh. Thompson, I said chivalry was red. I said dead. I know, sometimes I say words and I replace the first letter with Oh, R. so when I'm doing that, it's not okay. You ain't never done it, Mom. Don't mess with me. You moved the whole table. No, I didn't. Anyway. What's that was our toilet. I said. We just, yeah, we just got a new uh, bathroom in the basement. We basically, like, we just, we opened up about an acre. Darius, that's we a... We opened up about an acre of our basement to, um, we have a bathroom over there, like a whole, like, we just got a kitchen down here. Um... It's <laughs> he lying, y'all. But I probably got our new bathroom. What? We had a bathroom, but it was like not really functional. Like we didn't use it. Uh mm -hmm. We had the pipes because it's like right below our upper stair, like our upper, like our upper bathroom. So basically, like throughout the house, when you go from the fifth floor down, it's just bathroom, 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 like right under each other. Y'all can listen to y'all watch it. We don't have five floors. <laughs> we have three. I'm just kidding. When you have a basement, they only counted as two. Really? So we have two two floors in the basement. Mm -hmm. But anyway, um, yeah. So bathroom, new toilets, doing this, learning how to walk. <laughs> you know that poor boy. Um, you a trail. So it has some spurts sometimes. I don't know. We're looking to fix that. Mmm. You did. <laughs> I am <laughs> I am not a three year old. I'm some mmm this is so good. Mmm No. That is not making more appetizing. I said mmm. Mm. That's what you be like. You be like mm, This is so delicious. I sell it better than that. Yeah, no, you don't. Mm, the apple fell in your mouth. You said, mmm. I didn't do all that. Yes, you did. I didn't do all that. The apple. I, no. When something's almost like falling out of your mouth, that's how you know it's good. Like when you're eating something and it's. Mm, it, and it's like, you're going. Yeah, you no. That to get it in. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's good. I no. It's good. I don't know. And she tried it. She said, the apple almost fell out. She said, mmm. You said, ah. Uh, <laughs> I love it. You want to leave me alone. Anyway, so Monique. Oh yeah, Monique. Mo to the. E e to that's the. not Monique. What is it? <laughs> that's Moesha. Same thing. Wait, is that a different show? Yes. Are you serious? Who's Moesha? Mo M to the. O to the. It's Mo to the. E to the. Okay, whatever. But who? Wait, who is that? Like, what, I don't know her face. Brandy. Is it really Brandy? Yeah. Brandy can sing. Did you know that? Brandy can blow. Put Beyonce on her toes. <laughs> <laughs> like you don't want to bring Beyonce to anything. Uh, right. You really don't. Brandy and Monica. That was my Brandy girl. can sing better than Monica. You think so? Yes. I think they kind of tie. And Jasmine Sullivan is an amazing singer. That's I'm not scared of Lions of the Tigers, Bears girl. Is she better than Beyonce? See, there's like different, like there's different types of mm -hmm. being good at singing. Mm -hmm. You can't just say like, okay, you know, Jasmine Sullivan and Brandy are like good with the riffs. They're good with. Now, uh uh, what? Uh, that was your riff. Yes. That's what, that's mm -hmm. it, Brandy and that Jasmine Sullivan. Oh my God, I love Jasmine Sullivan. Oh my God, if you don't know who that is, you definitely should look her up. She's giving me body, she's giving me life. Um, now, Fantasia. Her car go, go. Fantasia and Jennifer Hudson are on like the same level to me. Let me say that Fantasia can blow, I'll say that again. She can, mm -hmm. she can. They got soul. They yes. like up there with Patti LaBelle. And, um, right, so that's Aretha what it Franklin. is. Mm -hmm. I don't know what Brandy and Jasmine Sullivan are, but they're very good singers too. Now, Beyonce, and Monica. Beyonce may not be singing soul or whatever that is, R and B or whatever. 
Well, she is. But she may not be singing so like that. But Beyonce's voice is so powerful. And like, I, no one underestimates her. I don't know what I'm saying, why I'm saying that. Um, Derek, <coughs> when we was looking at Dream Girl. No. <laughs> Mom always talks about this situation. That? Mom, that was directed. She couldn't do anything about it. She couldn't. I can guarantee if she wanted to do that, Derek. she could have. Mm -mm. Uh uh. I gotta put that scene up. <laughs> no. No. When I told you that movie, and I saw her, mom, and they it start singing, was not Beyonce's fault. Derek, she couldn't just say, "Well, I'm gonna be pop pop for the Jennifer Hudson." She could have. No. She could have been up Derek, there. She did her She could have been she up did there too. She did not do as best as she could. Mm -hmm. Cause it, they, they probably wanted it to be like that. Yeah. And back then, Beyonce wasn't for some like Beyonce has just literally her voice is so cultured right now. Like I don't know what the word is, not culture, but like so. Uh, uh, what is it called? Like when it's very, it's so precise, it's fine tuned. It's like back then, Beyonce was finding it, not finding her voice, but she was killing it. She was killing it. She's always been killing it since day one. I don't know how she. You know, no, no, no was their first single. Ever. Like, can you imagine like me just dropping a single and tomorrow blowing up? Like you? I'm not talking to you anymore. Really? Tell me some rue. Rue? You. <clears throat> anyway, Beyonce, um, her voice was kind of like, it was almost like immature. Like she wasn't getting in her stages yet. Like her voice is kind of high pitched. Oh my god, it was so good. When her voice was higher, Malika always tries to say, she can't hit them notes no more. Okay, and Rihanna never could hit the notes. Now, she didn't need no, it. No, she didn't need it. No, she, she didn't. didn't. <laughs> like, why is she getting the conversation? <laughs> she did. No, because he, he's always standing Rihanna, and it's, it's Rihanna versus Beyonce with me and him. But whatever, that's besides the point. Beyonce was, um, you know, finding her, her voice, and now that it's, like, lower, she sings so much better to me. Like, when she was skinny back in the day. She didn't sing better than you? Oh, you no, said she, she sounds sings, so much. She sounds, she sounded uh, extremely, like, amazing. Back then, she's, ki she was kill she's always been killing it, mom. But now she's killing it 10 times more. That's how much you, that's how you, how you know how much I love Beyonce. Like, she's always been killing okay, it, but she beat herself. Whatever. Back to what I was saying. <clears throat> Her voice is so much powerful now. I feel like because it's lower, it makes it better. Mm hmm And she just, she has so much control. Beyonce, I will tell you this. Beyonce literally has... I, I can't I can't name anybody who has as much control of her voice than over Beyonce in the industry. Control, mom. Her voice, like she could just I don't know, like she, you could just like it's just so, like you don't expect her to do, to do what she does. Like you, you the type of person that spent two two thousand dollars to go see her three. Yes, grand, I would. Five grand. Now, that's a lot, but of your money. No, I don't know if I would do all of that because it's not like okay, it's not like I'm going to meet her. And like, say, about like, and like she's gonna know what who my, say, what my name is. What they say you can get seven thousand dollars. Seven thousand dollars will give you tickets and a meet a meet with uh Beyonce with picture. How long is the meet? Like, am I getting? Is it just a picture? It is a picture, and you get to say she's like, oh, just the back that she knows is. my name. And she do this. No. And she walk <laughs> <it up. laughs> no, I'm not doing. <laughs> and then she walk. No. And she goes to the next person. Um, if you're Beyonce, you're not doing petty meeting greets. No, you will. No money can buy that's your what, time. That's what I'm saying. But I'm saying she probably would do. But seven thousand's a lot, mom. Yeah, but you're going to meet her. I, I better be on the bus. You I better be on the tour bus. You taking a picture? I'm coming with you. I'll be at every. I'll be in Vancouver. I'll be in Sacramento. <laughs> I'm going. To, I'm going to all the cities for seven thousand. Australia 000. and all that places. Yeah, I'm gonna be backstage too, going like this. With the with the uh, the stage manager, I'm gonna say not for oh. seven grand. She said blue light does not look good on black girls. Who said that? Beyonce. She said blue light does not look good on black girls. You never seen that blue light. Oh my god, Beyonce What's just has light? so much like blue light, like just lighting. Like when she's on stage, she they have blue light on. She said uh uh. Oh my god, I, you know what I love so much watching the videos and Beyonce's just in control. Like she she literally will have all these people going. Like she'll be sitting down, just like, just so hard pressed. Like you see on her face, and she's like, she's like looking at all the designs that these people are giving to her. And she's going, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. If you see over here, if you look, blue light does not look good on black girls. And when I'm when I'm standing right there, I want the light to be shining from this way and not that way. In order for the audience to see me, I need them to see me from from right there. Who made this? No, I don't want it. Also, when I I want the the, the violins to come in after the piano. You you hear? Just play it for a second. 
right there. That's when I wanted to come in because otherwise they won't feel the, the... I just love that. She's just giving me, she knows what she wants. <laughs> I promise there's videos everywhere we're doing that. There's videos of her everywhere and she's always has, a, there's pictures like of her sitting down and there's literally pictures and pictures of the stage of the set around her and she's just looking so confused and co so confuzzled like she doesn't know what to do and that's why her performances are top notch she has a hand in everything she doesn't let anything go oh my goodness they say <laughs> oh my god she says she works so hard they had they had this candle thing but they, they had to put each individual candle and they had to set it up and it, it took them two hours and she looked at it she said actually i need i don't want the candles take them away take them away and they said, but we just, and she said, I'm sorry, take them away. She said, I don't want it. Now, most people would think that's cruel, but if you have an image. That's not cruel mind, if she said a nice way. I mean, she wants what she wants. Right, yeah. She wants what she wants. Now, I don't know what's on your pepper. Now, anyway, back to Monique. That's a uh, What's her name? Monique. Okay, but what's Monique to each then? I promise it's, it's not brandy. It's uh, Brent. Is it really brandy? Moesha, the, the, uh, the sitcom. Moesha is Brandy? Yes. Like Brandy is Moesha or she's just in that show. Brandy is Mo I don't I'm too young. I remember <laughs> All I remember is Mo to the Eater. Brandy Ita. is Moesha, boy. Okay, Google. Moesha. These kids these days, I swear. Ooh, that is Brandy. Moesha Mitchell is a teenager juggling school, friendships, and romance. Teenager. I always I was like, is there another black Mo to the E to the and then Monique played in Parkers. Yeah, the Parkers. It is a baga. It was a, like the Parkers was a. Uh, what that girl who's doing a lot on that hip hop show? You talking about uh, uh Countess? Is that her name in real life? What is it, Countess Vaughn? Well, yeah, that's her name. She was killing it on the show, and when I saw her. And the, uh, ten, ten years diva, later, diva, yeah, diva, VH1, what's this, diva something? When I saw her ten years later, she was not looking cute on the R. show. R&B diva, or something like that, yeah. Oh well. Oh my gosh, she was doing a lot. She's just speaking her mind. Anyway, listen. So well, if there, you guys haven't heard, mm -hmm. um, Monique was was has been going around, you know, uh, reference clothes, America. Mm-hmm. And she's been saying, "Listen up, um, we're boy everyone boycott Netflix." Is what she's saying. Oh, mm -hmm. she's saying boycott Netflix. Um, and here's why. So basically, she was in touch with Netflix or whatever, because you know that all these like you know comedians will end up having like stand up comedy shows and you know these stuff that they do at like these older comedians that you haven't seen in you know in a mm -hmm. while, yeah. and they come on mm -hmm. to Netflix and they do a special, like a Netflix special, right? And they just like tour around, and then they Netflix like makes the show for them. And they put it on Netflix, and everyone's going ah, rah, 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 right? Mm -hmm. So, <clears throat> you know, Chris Rock did it, mm -hmm. Dave Chappelle, mm -hmm. Amy Schumer, I think has one uh -huh. or something like that, and they get paid X amount of money, right? right? Not all of them together, but they just get paid X amount of money, right? So, they offer her, they offered her Monique. Five hundred thousand dollars. Right. That's sleep change. That is chump change, mom. For Monique, that is chump change. You can okay. tell me half a million dollars. I can give me a right reality now, TV show. Right now, it may not be chump change in her life. You don't know because she's not doing too much. I don't know what gig she has on the side. Do you think she's doing a lot right now? Yeah, but I'm. Do you think that she doesn't have? She's. But I she's know not she's broke, though. What do you think? Does she work? She worked more than five hundred grand though. She's definitely working with Bobby Grant, and that was her point. She was saying, why right. all these comedians, right. who you guys called legends, right. getting... She... Oh, my goodness. I don't know if this is accurate or not, but that, that offer that they gave her was 127th of what they offered Amy Schumer. Wow. 120... Amy Schumer hasn't even been a comedian for that long. Oop! She dragged her. She said... <laughs> okay, so this is what happened. Oh, I'm, I'm missing this story. Okay. So, Charlemagne... Named her do Donkey of the Day. Oh my God! Why did he do that? He said that she was Donkey of the Day, and of course she wasn't having it. So she said, "I'm about to be on the show." So she went on. She went on the Breakfast Club. She said, "Listen up, Charlemagne. I don't know why you called me Donkey of the Day, because I'm not the one." She said, "There's no reason why I should be Donkey of the Day when I'm I'm just standing up for said, my you, rights or something." But she said, "Would you call your mama a Donkey?" Yeah. That's what my husband said. Yeah, that's what she said. She said, would you call your mama or your grandma a or something like that? Mm-hmm. It's the truth, though. 
But still, you're not. She's not immune to to the public eye. He can do whatever he wants to. That's his show. Sure, he can. Sure, he can. So I don't think it matters if it was his mom or his grandma. If he wouldn't call them that, because she she's not his mom or his grandma. She's someone in the public eye, so she should be. Anyway, I'm not against Monique. <laughs> um, right. So so is she right about her being a legend? Now listen. Now this is what she was claiming. She said, "I'm a legend. I'm a legend. I'm a legend." I don't need this 500k. I should be able to say Netflix. I want this, and they give it to me because I'm a legend. I'm a I'm a uh, black female comedian, and I should make this amount. Who, I'm not. She's not being who outrageous. Who was one of those that paid the way? Right. For other black comedians. Right. Uh, especially being, especially being black. Especially being black and female. Right. So, Charlemagne Charlemagne's point was that the only reason why they didn't offer that amount of so money. Because she's not popping right now. Because she's not popping right now. And that's because she, they're, he's claiming that, you know, Chris Rock and Amy Schumer and Dave Chappelle have been selling out arenas. Oh. You know, not necessarily doing anything in the public eye, but they've been selling out arenas. Like, they, they tour. Since when? He's saying they recently, recently have oh. been selling out arenas. And so Netflix takes those numbers and says, okay, we know that people still have an interest in you. That's why we're going to give you this much money. All right. And Monique hasn't been busy right. for a while. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know. She's, she did a, a movie in 2016, but it's like, she hasn't been like selling out arenas is what Charlamagne was saying. But she said she made a, she, that movie made $17 million, Yeah. And she said, well, no. it took $17 million to make that Her, movie. The budget, and they made $45. And then 40, right. So she's saying that that movie gross had a, a huge profit. And then she dragged Amy Schumer's movie uh, called... Whatever that movie was with her and her mom, not her real mom, but she was mm -hmm. in the movie. It was like a comedian movie, or whatever. And she said they only made three. They had their budget was like forty. I get this wrong. Forty-five million, and then they let, they only made like forty-eight million. The point was that they only made three million in profit, uh -huh. and she made from seventeen to forty-five million. Right. So whatever. <clears throat> so she's saying, why don't I get the um, why don't I get the money I deserve? Amy Schumer's getting. 27 times what I what they're offering me and they're telling me that Amy Schumer is I'm a legend I've been here for decades and I can only get 500,000 That's just I mean I think it's wrong but that's how the world works If you ain't hot and you ain't popping it's only a certain time it's Yeah but they don't know if she's not hot or popping she just hasn't done any and then that's what I'm saying. You gotta keep yourself busy because if you don't, the people was not gonna know you, and you end up. It's like you you got your time to shine, and then you got your time to just be in the background. Right, and when she's been in the background for a couple years, and that's when people get Netflix shows. Dave Chappelle's old, but they're, Dave Chappelle, they're, they're still legends. Dave that's what I'm saying. They're legends. Just, he keeps himself busy though. Now he has been. He's not been in the limelight for a long time, Mom. You haven't heard Dave Chappelle I doing have. nothing. Where? You I have not heard have. Dave Chappelle for 10 yes, years. Yes, I have. Let me see. Dave Chappelle. Well, you gotta look it up. It's too much. Yeah. I thought he has been doing something. Now, I Chris Rock been... had a show. No, 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 no. I thought Dave Chappelle has been busy. And I swear Chris Rock has another... He has like, And I don't even see Chris Rock. Chris, Chris Rock. Chris Rock? Was, Chris Rock was doing Everybody Hates Chris. Everybody I hates know. Chris. But what I'm saying is, I thought Dave Chappelle oh was busy. Because Doing ain't he, what? Ain't he in um he don't live where he live? I don't know. He didn't he don't have his show on Comedy Central anymore. He used to. But that was is that a long time ago? I don't know. I don't know. When I see the nineties, I'm not the one. It comes from ninety three. What ninety seen to you was like what? Ninety three to me is before I was born. That's what it is to me. So. Oh, so in, two, in September 2017, he was uh, Chappelle was awarded an Emmy Award for his guest appearance on Saturday Night Live. His, he signed a 20 million per, 20 million per release comedy special deal with Netflix in 2016. 20 million? Yes. And she's getting 500k. And he I currently, believe her. And he I currently believe her. has four Netflix specials. So he's been keeping himself busy. Four? Yeah. No. I'm about to clock Netflix. That's, that's, that's what I said. I know he was keeping his And safe. then, okay, so she was pleading, she was pleading racism and and gender bias or whatever, right? And Charlamagne was saying, well, you can't do that. You can't do that. But come on now. $20 million. Darius. Darius. He's keeping She's crying. getting 500000 Are you nuts? Monique. Well. I'm on her side. Right. That That is way too low. And then Charlamagne was going, well, what do you, what are you asking for? Because if five hundred is not enough, five hundred thousand is not enough for you. What do you want? And she said, because basically, when apparently when you sign these contracts with Netflix, you can't do anything else. So oh. for the for the, the the contract for those two years, 
or whatever it is that was stated in the contract, you can't do any other work. Oh. Uh, that's what that's what Monique was saying. Mm -hmm. So she's saying whatever I could have made in those two years without Netflix, that's what I want them to pay me if I'm not going to be able to work at all. That's true. So they're going to pay all the five hundred dollars. Five hundred thousand a year per for, contract. I think it's for that. Contract. I don't know what it was for that for that Netflix special. Um. And I'm not the one. And, and yeah. let me see how much Amy Schumer made because I can't do five hundred k times twenty seven in my head. Can you mind? Um, that's probably roughly forty two thousand a month or what? Forty five thousand? What you mean? Thirteen and a half million. For what? Oh, you talking about for her? Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about Oh, what, you were what, uh, Monique, yeah. Well you said oh for her. For Amy Schumer. Right. She got thirteen 13. and a half thirteen point five million. They did Monique Dirty. They did. I didn't even see the numbers until now. They did Monique oh, Dirty. I didn't know that. That's bad. They did Monique Dirty. They, they did Monique Dirty. More. They brought that girl, the other girl. 13, 13 million, million more. They did Monique Dirty. What is it because Amy of her? Schumer hasn't they even been around? They may not like her because of what her attitude. Well, yes. The Monique other, the other allegations mind. were. She speaks her mind. The other allegations were that. people don't like Monique because. They everyone said that she's difficult to work with. Now she didn't really. Re she she was basically saying people don't like when I because she said I don't like when people get bullied or something. She said she's like I won't let anybody get bullied. So if somebody has a problem on set, I'll, I'm gonna step in or whatever. So people th said that she's difficult to work with because she doesn't like seeing bullying. Because oh, this is what she, <laughs> this is what she said. So she was doing. This, I don't know if she was doing a movie or something, and the director was black. He was a black man. And I guess he had this vision or whatever, and the producer was doing a lot, she said. The producer was doing a lot. Tell him some the producer was trying to overrule the director. And she said, listen up, she said, listen up, honey bear. She said, listen up here. You're not gonna tell this black director, because the producer's white. I guess she's bringing in race to this one too. But she said, you're not gonna tell this black director that he can't do what he wants to when he's the director of this movie. Why are you why is the producer overruling the director when the director has a vision? He should be able to to do what he wants with this movie, and you, you as the white producer is trying to trying to be the director. You're not the director. That's not your that's not your role. So she checked him because the director was doing this. I guess he couldn't fend for himself. And then they were like, "Well, she's being difficult." And then 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 she just said, "I don't like seeing people bullied." That's what she said. She said, "I don't like but seeing people." But how was that bullying? He just telling him a direction. What do you mean? No, the producer was trying basically trying to direct the movie, like disregarding what the director was saying. Oh. And like oh, say, oh, was, yeah, his boundaries. overstepping his boundaries. Yeah. And so she's like, I'm not the one. Not on this black director. Well. I wonder if the roles are reversed if she would have done something. I mean, and then Charlamagne was like, don't bring in race and gender to this when you know that it's not the reason. And I was going, oh my God. <laughs> I was going over. Oh my God, but she, if you watch the video, she did, oh my God, she, she checked him. She really did. He got, he got, he didn't even know what to say. I know, they said he got read. They, he did get read. They said he got read through the whole thing. Like a hardcover book. Right. He got read. <laughs> and he was and then her um her husband was on the phone, who's that uh yeah. was her manager, I guess. Mm -hmm. And he was checking him too. There was a lot. Charlamagne was going, Oh my god. He's going, Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I feel bad for Monique though. I do too. They did they rip like they did her she, dirty. She is a very she's a she's a She's a very she's one of those women that's very strong and people can misunderstand her strength and the way that she comes off But she's very she's also very sensitive. And she lost weight, too. I know she lost a lot of weight But she's very sensitive and things get to her easily That's why she's quick to pop off and say things because she has been through a lot. What would, what would you do if you were Monique? Would you be telling people to boycott Netflix? No I want to tell you what boycott Netflix. I, Netflix. I just think it's very important that if you are a person that is doing a role like comedian, you don't need to let yourself rest. You not. You need to be like like Beyonce. Keep going, 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 yeah, going. Yeah, but going. people, but people rest all the time and come back into the business. No, I'm not talking about. I'm not. I'm not talking about taking a five year hiatus. I'm talking about. You know, you rest, you can rest. Well, she has been resting for a long time. That's what I'm saying. You can rest. I can understand you taking a vacation. I'm taking a little vacation here. But I'm not talking, like, a few months. But don't let your, your name be a not, a not known. Do you understand what I'm saying? Can you imagine being known? Just keep going. And then, like, you, you, took, you took the vacation that was lo long enough for no return. 
Like, can you imagine being like, okay, I made it. I made it. They, everybody knows my name. Everybody knows my name. That's what people have done. People have done that you before. You took too long of a, a break and then without you come anything. Back. And then you, and you try to come back and you are not it Like Like uh, Bryson Tiller? Smell the roses. Did oh, he oh my God. Yeah, but he didn't try to take a break. He, he, he tried to come back. He thought it was I going, know, because y'all, I was He tried to come back and then not say Bryson anything. Tiller, he was, he, man, he was hot last year. Was it last year? Mm. Two, two years ago. 2016. He was on top charts. He was killing he, it. 2016. Like, yeah, he was doing Bryson, it. Bryson, 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 Anyways, oh my God, I know. I was just like, man. Ain't nobody heard no. It's called True to Self. Anybody he ain't did one after that, did he? Well, because it was 2017. He, oh, he, he was on Wild Thoughts. Thoughts. That's his biggest song of 2017. You know, I get wow, wow, wow. Yeah. That was it. I ain't never heard Bryce Tiller since. He had his album. I ain't even listened to it. I tried. I tried three or four songs, and it was a no. And that's that's a, that's a lot of time. When I try to listen to an album and you're not giving it to, to me within the first three songs I listen to, that's 15 minutes of my time you wasted. Cause all those songs I didn't like, I don't have time to go through your 20 song album to find one one good song. That's why I look for the stars. I look for the ones that people like, and I listen to those only. And then I say, oh, if I like those a lot, then I'll go listen to the other songs. Say maybe they're good artists, and other people don't like them. It's hard out here. It really is. To be to keep yourself upbeat with the with the with the times, cause you never know. You never know what people's people are gonna be. That's why Beyonce is just one of the biggest stars of this generation. Like she does. That's because she has changed sound songs. Like her no, song. Let me be, tell you, I feel her like song is very kind of weird. Like it's not like other people's songs. Yes. I don't know what that means. Darius. Are you talking about Lemonade? Are you talking about Beyonce self-titled? What are you talking about? Uh, her songs, her albums, they weird. Lemonade, Beyonce self-titled. Are you talking about four? Are you talking about what, what are those? Her her albums. Can you sing one? Lemonade's the most recent one. Let that's, me hear it. That's what she's giving me culture. She's giving me I'm black, and she's giving me right. And she in a, walking with some shoes off in the in the jungle. Yeah, she's the, right with the sand. No, see what I'm saying. I'm just kidding. <laughs> She's not in the bungalow. She's not in the bungalow. It was in a bungalow. But she was. And then she saw all these people. They sitting on the steps. Oh my she God! She's always killing it. She's giving me mother. <laughs> she's giving me mother Pat. I was like, she's giving me mother, uh, mother of the generations. When oh my gosh, that that picture is iconic. She's just sitting on the stairs, and you have Zendaya, just like, there and there's there's people just laying on her shoulder. Like this, she's giving me, and she's just looking straight ahead and giving me face and body. She's killing it, mom. Be oh my gosh, and her visuals on stage. Did you see her Grammy performance when she was pregnant? Mom, have, name Darius, the, I don't want to hear Name the last this. artist. I don't want to hear all this. Name the last artist you saw perform anywhere on live television pregnant. Erykah Badu. Who is that? Really? Who is that? I saw her pregnant, I thought, on stage. She was not singing. I don't know what she was Beyonce doing. was pregnant with twins, and she was giving me life. She said, uh huh, huh. She didn't sing that song, but she, oh my gosh. And she literally, everyone was scared because she had this chair on stage and the chair was tilting backwards. Like she had it at a, uh, at a uh, angle. I don't know what degree this is, but she was like this. And she was tilting back and she was pregnant, mom. And then she would walk down and then like her poetry, none of this, none of that she wrote, but <laughs> the poetry that she was saying over the loudspeaker, it was, she was killing it. She said, she said, you're nothing like your mother. You're everything like your mother. And she's giving me like, see what I'm saying? She's giving me, oh my gosh. And then hold up. She is in oh underwater, mom. God. She's underwater. I see. And she's giving me body and she's giving me like bubbles coming out of her mouth. And she's like, I rested for 60 days. Oh my God. Me and Malik see what I'm saying? Her. That's what but I'm that's saying. poetry, But mom. I understand that, but it's not what that's people are doing. Coming so from the roots. it is unique. Now she didn't make any of that poetry. But I'm saying but. is she stand on top of herself. She didn't. Mm-mm. Anyway. Mm -mm. She stand on top of the game. 
by inventing new stuff, stuff that people have never heard of. So people are like, oh, I'm curious. So they're curious well, to see, and then it, then when you hear it, because I let me tell you something. When I hear some songs, the very first time, I'll be like, that's so weird. But it's weird, so I feel like you guys don't. Weird but is, then weird is when you cool hear it now. over, it's like. You got to hear over and over and over again. You're like, oh, okay. It's catchy. I like it. Weird is the thing these days. Like, I feel like if I play you a song, you don't know what's going on. <laughs> You're going, what is this? There, like, you play a lot of songs. Like, like Lady Gaga. This. Do you know, can you name a Lady Gaga song? I want to know what you know. Can you name a Lady Gaga song? Like, can you sing one? Do you remember mm -hmm. anything? Sing, sing Do you one. know, um... Hmm. I'm on the edge. Of glory, and I'm hanging on the arm with you. I'm on the edge, the edge, the edge, yeah. the edge, the edge. That's that's Lady Gaga. Or, um, I live for the applause, applause. No. Oh, I forgot the other one. There's a lot more songs. Um, there's um. What what happened to that girl, Adele? She's, she's still with... in. She's still in. What's she saying now? Um. She came out with 25. She, oh my God, Adele did a lot. Like her albums are, are her, her age. Oh my God, she s looks so old for 25. Like I didn't realize she was 25 until I realized that her, her albums correspond to her age. Oh. She's 25 years old and she, I promise you she looks 40. I didn't know she was 25. Like her face doesn't look 40, like she doesn't have wrinkles or anything, but just her face. I don't know if it's her weight. Like not that she's big, but like, I don't know what makes her look so old. I didn't know she was 25, I thought she was my age. I me too. She's twenty five, mom. She's Are you literally sure one is? year. Mom, I promise her. Her albums correspond to her age. She's only twenty five years old, no. and she looks ninety two. Okay, what about Taylor Swift? Taylor Swift's in. Well, actually, the I promise you, twenty seven years. I seen so her. I told my mom. Me, and my mom was talking about that. I said, "Which Taylor, Taylor Swift? That twenty seventeen was a bad year for artists. I promise. Now, not that Taylor Swift Chris. did bad. But she what? didn't do. Oh my goodness, Chris Brown. All uh, right, let me not stop talking about because he keep on stopping. He made a forty-something song album, and I haven't heard one song. I've heard "Let Me Switch Up the Tempo," and I switched up the tempo on him, and I left his album. That's what I did. Now, Taylor Swift, she was giving me my reputation has never been worse. So you must like me for me. We can make any promises. No. You know I never that song. Heard it. Yeah, because it's not popular. I like that song, but it's not popular. Now, she was giving me, um, ooh, look what you make me do. Oh, look yeah, I like that. Me do. Look what look. you make me do, made me do. Yeah. Oh, whatever. Yeah. I heard that song. I hate that song. And I did a cover on my Yes, you on did my do thing. that. Yes, you on did. On my thing. I hate that song so much. What song did she that make that was popular? Literally nothing, I promise. Like, that album was a flop to me. You talking about Taylor? Too. Yeah, Taylor. But Taylor was so hot in 2012. Oh my Every god, she killed, killed it to the baby. Whole, now we got blood. bad blood. Well, yeah, she had everything. And used to be, she killed it. Be, like, I would, tell, I would give her this. Taylor was one of the most unexpected artists to ever just. She snapped. She, she did literally stuff snapped. with T.I. She did. She was the hottest thing. You she get, you had No, when Taylor she was younger, on she, your was doing, she was doing, you, you know. Today. She was doing country and stuff like that. And she's like, I know that, but then she the stopped. Boy next door or something like that. I don't yeah. know. And then, all of a sudden, she said, she said, hmm, I don't like this song. She's like, I don't like this country. I'm just going to change genres. It's hard for me to just change genres and pick it up. She changed genres. She said, pop and she sounds. Snapped. She said, pop sounds nice. She snatched it. She said, okay, top charts for weeks. I know. For months. She killed it with 1989. I know. She gave me style. You never go out of style. You. Yeah. She 22. killed it. She's 22. Ooh. Yeah. And she gave me, baby, now we got, oh my God, she was giving me hit after hit. She said, baby, now we got bad blood. And then she said, and I got a blank space, baby. And then she did something else. She, she did, did like it. so many more songs. Wildest dreams of. Yeah. She killed it with every other song she did. I don't know. I love Taylor Swift. I don't like her. <laughs> but I like her songs. That's the same with Ariana Grande. I love Ariana Grande too. I'm just thinking about all the stars and I just love all of them. Ariana Grande, like I don't want to like her so much, but her voice is literally so good. Why don't you like her though? Um, I heard she does a lot. You heard? No, but she does. You can't go like, I just don't like hear. her. Like, I just don't want to like her. I don't know why. Like, have you ever heard someone you just don't want to like? No. Mm, well, I do. I just don't want to like her. 
But I love her. I love Ariana Grande. Like I just want her to come out with another album. Okay, I don't like people so like she's you. my guilty pleasure. I do not like people like that because you can't even get she's, chance to know what you just going by. Oh my god, she said. killed. She came and she said, every time I'm alone, I can help thinking about you. She killed it. Did she sound she like killed that. It. Oh. All I need, all I see, I don't know the lyrics. It's just me and you. She killed. Like she's just giving me. Uh, so much. I, I didn't see. Just, I didn't, just I didn't see a lot of that. I love you. You. She's just. She's giving me like I don't know, but she's giving. I just love her voice so much. I don't know. She's giving me Broadway. She can do a lot of stuff. Now Beyonce is just on a whole nother tier. Okay. Of everything. Me, so we're gonna go. I'm gonna clock out. Is the binary going dead? Yeah. You guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with anyone, everyone. Let me know what your girl and the fam bam is doing on this channel. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video with Zaddy Chunk Chunk in the house. Uh, I may do one with Darius too. Darius, will do Mexican food next? All alone, I can help. Mama, <laughs> when? You know what? Quando. Can't talk to him when he full. Quando. When he hungry? No story. Quando. Oh, what I you forgot mean? you don't know Spanish. <laughs> what I you mean? I promise you, I thought you knew what I was talking about. What you mean? Quando means when. Oh, I was just about to say money. <laughs> no, Quando was money. Money. No, dinero. Quando. Dinero. dinero. Oh, that's all. I, 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 if you said dinero, I wouldn't know that was money. What's mano? I think one. it's mano. Mano is fist. I thought mano was one. No, mom. In English. Oh. I'm not y'all. I'm letting everyone know. You don't know Uno is one? Uno is one. I'll be letting everyone know that I just said mono. You said mono's one. And hey, what's mono? In English, mono is mono, like it's like one. Like there's dual, there's mono. There's... Okay, then yeah, that's what I'm saying. So why is that not right? I guess. Whatever. Thank you. It hmm. might, I don't know, it might mean one or something, like in another, like as, you know. But like, the mono, what'd you say? Mono, I swear it's fist, like fist to fist, like mono. Do you know? <sighs> that reminds me of my younger day. I just had a nostalgic feeling. I was wondering where I, I knew that from. <gasps> a nostalgic feeling. A nostalgic? Nostalgic, what do you think about your childhood? A who? A nostalgic. A nostalgic. Okay, I don't know. I had I a never nostalgic heard feeling. When I, remember we used to have the Xbox Connect? Okay. The the where you could where you it was like the new hottest thing no controller uh -huh. like they just scanned your body and right. we thought it was we thought they were killing it uh -huh. so then we got the Xbox Connect and there was this game with these like you would fight them right it was like exercise right uh -huh. you would fight these people and I remember one of the guys opening lines was something we're gonna fight mano e mano and I was like dad what does that mean he said fist to fist so that's where I learned that from but then I was remembering I remember I, I, I always lost that game I always lost and I remember being a poor soggy wet boy because yeah. I was sweating yeah. and I was a, a, and a sore loser in 6th grade and I was a sore loser I was and your crying. daddy used to always be up downstairs talking to you telling you to stop being a sore loser and I said I can't get up I remember that I can't get up because I can hear y'all always from upstairs I was a, I've always a sore loser. I'm not now. But I, I I don't know. I just didn't like being beaten. Beaten? And think, like, beaten. Defeated? Yeah. I didn't like that. Anyways, y'all. I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Peace. All alone, I care. You know, thinking about you. I'll play it for you. I don't want you to play for me. All alone. I thought you was going to sing it. All alone. It's just me and you. There's this how you sound. What is it called? Um. Uh. Who's the Rihanna song? Rihanna. I'm just kidding. I love Rihanna too. The fly song. Fly, yeah. To fly. Mm. -mm. So what's the song? How it go? To fly. No. I don't know what. Um, what is it called? How you um, doing? Yeah, I know what you're talking about. The, you mean the chorus part, right? Yeah. Um, for days upon days. I actually just think of the Kimi Nash's part. Um, <clears throat> Hiya. I came to win, to fly, to prosper, to ride. I came to win, to survive, to prosper. To fly. I made that up. To yeah. fly. 
to fly. I came to win, to, to fly, fly, to prosper, to ride. I came to win, to survive, to prosper, to ride. That's every day. Wait till you get copyrighted, wait. <laughs> yeah! Get out! Get it out! Can we get copyrighted for you just say it? Stop! No. I don't wanna hear it! That's it. All alone, I can baby boy, thinking about you. She killed it. From that? All alone, I don't see, I don't I don't know what these lyrics are. It's just me and you. Okay. I don't know how this battery is still here. Bye. Bye. Ready to go. You know.